46-year-old Sharjah resident Haider Taleb Erabe was diagnosed with polio at the age of four. He hasn't been able to walk since then, but he never considered it a handicap. Instead, it has been a challenge that continues to inspire him to do great things. He is building a second version of the solar-powered wheelchair that took him on a historic trip across three Emirates on UAE National Day last year. This year we decided to make it a little bit smaller. We used uh, four solar uh, panels instead of two panel, two solar. They are a little bit smaller and it can enter the doors at houses or malls or anywhere. So the disabled will be more uh, freedom, freedom to move around in uh, any place he like to move to. This improved version will have more mobility with its smaller and movable solar panels compared to the first one he designed in 2009. The speed of this new set of wheels has also been increased from 10 to 13 kilometers per hour and will see him through the goal of setting a new world record in the Guinness Book that he aims to achieve on November 11. This record, uh, world record of Guinness will be from uh, Abu Zabi, Masdar City, till Azteca Club for Handicap in Sharjah. It's approximately 140 kilometers. We are supposed to cut it in uh, uh, 12 hours. And it will be uh, under the longest distance can be uh, cut by a disabled on a solar wheelchair. Once he's achieved this feat, Hyder says there's no slowing him down. He will embark on an awareness trip in selected schools and shopping malls across the seven Emirates beginning November 22. One message is for non-disabled that uh, the disabled people are a part of this society and they can do everything if they had the chance. Uh, the second message I would like to send it for the disabled. If uh, Haider as a disabled can do it, you can do it as a disabled, you can do anything you want. It's only that you have to have uh, a, a, an idea and you have to stick to it and you can do it. So we are moving in the morning for schools, universities. In the evening we'll be putting the solar wheelchair in the malls and we'll be there to answer any question from the public. The 10-day journey will conclude on December 2nd at the Abu Dhabi Corniche where he will celebrate the UAE National Day. For good measure, a second chair has been built in case of an emergency during the long trip. It will take a couple more days before the main chair is ready, but Haider is all set to make history once again on his wheelchair. Khadija Sali, City 7 News.